So there are two different powder foundations that Mary Kay has. One is a mineral and one is a pressed powder. And I want to tell you guys a little bit today about them, about how they differ and what they do. So this is what they look like. This is our mineral. This is actually mine. I pulled from my bathroom. So that's why it looks like there's not a lot in there. Mineral foundation and then our pressed powder. Now, essentially, they're both powders. So they both are really, really fine powders. Um, and they're going to help to give you a natural finish. So if you're somebody who wants to look uh, matte, but you want soft, like feminine, matte finish. I always think a powder is a great way to finish things off. Whether you used a CC cream first, liquid foundation, cream to powder, I always use a mineral foundation overward, afterwards over whatever foundation I put on, especially because it's buildable. Our mineral foundation is buildable coverage. So if you're someone who loves the CC cream, the lightness of that, because it's like a tinted moisturizer, but you want a little bit more coverage, you'll probably like putting a mineral foundation over it because you can add multiple layers of this and it will give you more coverage. Now, the pressed powder isn't the same way. Um, it's going to give you a lightweight, kind of like translucent coverage in a way. Um, if you're looking for something that's going to set your foundation and keep oily people, not oily for the day, this one's going to be your friend. Um, that's not to say that somebody who's more, more normal to dry can't use a pressed powder, um, but it does a really good job of controlling oil for up to eight hours, like oil and shine. Whereas this one can control shine, but this one is more like directed towards that. So, um, I love the pressed powder, especially because our translucent powder, which is kind of like our setting powder, it does absorb oil. Um, it can have a little bit of like a sheen to it. It's not sparkly by any means, but like if you were to put on translucent powder and then take a picture, there might be some kind of a reflection. So if you're looking for something, um, especially brides or, you know, a, you're doing something where you're going to be taking a lot of photos, you might want the mineral pressed powder, um, the sheer mineral pressed powder to go over that and like set everything. This is great to have in a compact um, with a little um, like almost you could use a sponge, you could use a compact brush if you wanted to um, throughout the day to kind of um, touch up. But these are the two, this is our mineral, again I used it, pulled it from my bathroom which is why it's used, um, but our mineral powder brush, this is what you would use to put on this foundation. But I also brought our big overall powder brush because you could use this as well, especially with the pressed powder. Um, just a fun fact, if you like a bronzer that doesn't have any sparkle or any sheen to it, you can actually use these just in a darker shade than you are as your bronzer. So hope you learned something new and I hope you try out the pre our pressed powder or our mineral powder because I love the different options that Mary Kay has for foundations and there is going to be something for everybody.